Hello, are you ready for another fucking adventure? It's me, Woke here, and I'm here with- I'm back with some Tepin. As you can see from the last video, I was actually able to make it to champion rank. And before I- now that I can actually experiment with other decks now, and I can start doing some other weird matchups or trying to make other decks, but I just wanted to show off this deck specifically because this is the deck that got me to champion. Uh, it's not the greatest deck, especially when you compare it to a lot of other Morgans of its type, but I wanted to at least show it. Um, so it is obviously going here. It is a four pack deck and what is the wolf pack is a bunch of fours so we've got it's beltway this is the one where if you play a purple unit while another so the main gimmick of this deck is that you have to play um for a lot of these units they have to have already a four unit who's purple on the field already so Beltway is one of those, and if there's one there, then he automatically returns a four, um, four cost MP uh, enemy unit back to the hand, uh, back to the EX pocket. So if their EX pocket is full, I think that unit just dies. We got Four Eyes, who is extremely. This is the Ouroboros killer, in my eyes, because one of the two Ouroboros kills. But if there's um, another purple unit, MP cost four. Um, on the on your side of the field, then you can take control of a random enemy with four HP or fewer. That's not four HP starting. That is four HP as of the time you take it. So if they can give them more HP, or you can lower it down, you can steal it. Um, I'm using Spectre because I don't have enough another one, but he just gives plus one plus one to any purple uh, unit in your hand. That is the cost MP four. He's not the best, but I don't really have a choice on this one. Lupo, he's one of the few uh, four units that you can just play and it's perfectly fine. And, it does, and you can basically start combos with him. Another one, this is the better version, which I'm missing one. Um, this is Lupo. She gains uh, plus two, plus four if you have a four cost unit purple. Purple, four cost unit in your hand. And then we got Bertha. Uh, this is another one that can be played first, but anytime she's a resonate and anytime you activate a, an ability, she gives plus two HP to other four costs that are not her, which is great. And Vector, who, if there's another four cost purple on the field, he gets plus one, plus three. And also while he's on the field, he cannot be blocked. And then we got Hunk, who is a four cost two, two. He is a shield and every time a friendly purple unit dies, he gets plus one, plus one and a shield again. So that's kind of a deep dive. And then some other four units. I use Lilith. Personally, I use Lilith. There's a couple others you can use. But, oh, come on. Can you go to the next one? No? Okay. Um, I don't know. I love Lilith play, play, uh, fits my play style better. And then the other un other units in this deck that are um, uh, not fours that are, I run anyway are the legendary Devil Hunter Dante because he can turn into this guy right here. I'm still not the best using him, but he can be. He can definitely win you games. Uh, and then there's also Tigrex, which I only own one, but Tigrex is extremely good. <laughs> so, and then we got Brainwash. But yeah, that's basically the deck. That's kind of a more of a deep dive of the deck, but it's kind of different from the kind of decks I run, for the most part, at least you've seen me run. So I kind of wanted to explain it because once I'm actually playing, I don't know how the fuck I'm supposed to talk about what this deck does. So I'm not gonna play Champ. Um because uh, some of the giant people there are a little bit fucking crazy. So, and this is actually very hard to play right now because I'm currently balancing my mic with one hand and trying to play with the other. Okay, so we'll start with um, X over here. So let's see what we got. Oh, okay. So we actually have a turn where we can just play this. It's perfectly fine. Ooh. Interesting. I can actually return that guy back to the hand, can't I? Mm. I'll go here. Go here. Return that back to the hand. So I want to activate this at two. There we go. So here's the thing I wanted. This is what I, what I want X to do is to activate agility on his bird. Yep. Back to the hand. So there's nothing X can do to stop that. I know because green has absolutely no way to stop this deck. Well, that's not true. But there are ways to stop it, but it's pretty hard, I'd say. And this is also unfortunate for you because 
I also got another one of these guys. So he's about to return her back to the hand. And then she's dead now. And then I think any HP I've lost, I get back. This deck is so stupid good. <laughs> oh, I might actually lose you right here. It's unfortunate, but it is what it is. Yeah, no stopping that one. Hmm. Perfect. Um, I can use this. Unfortunately, I can't use another counter after that because I did not draw a perfect. Oh, that works because that doesn't uh, activate right away, so I can kill her. So, come on. Come on. Make it in time, make it in time, make it in time. Oh, I did. It's fine. She dies here anyway. Like I said. She dies here anyway. She better die here. Oh, she's not gonna die. This is actually... Oh, he might actually win. He could potentially win. By the way, he can't... He, there's no way fucking way he wins me. He beats this. Okay. Unless you've got a shit ton of those in your hand, my dude. You are not gonna win this. Like I said. Not gonna win this. Came close, though. Um, X is, listen, X is not as bad as he was in the previous game, and he actually came very close to beating me, so I really should not, I should stop underestimating X, is what I'm saying. But you can see, that's kind of the way the deck runs, is that, like, once you get some of your stuff rolling, funny enough, the, I think Zen has said the one way to really beat him is to just play so much, or their, my specific board has to be just so full that you can't do anything, so... Oh, Raffle Woken, I hate you. Really not the greatest hand in the world. So I'm going to use this right away. That's even worse. Holy shit. Please activate something. He can't. Oh, that's even worse. All right, activating again. Uh, did you, are you fucking kidding me? I literally drew every single beltway. Okay, that's better. Oh, shit. She's five. Yeah, there's another. I might lose this one. I don't think I can do anything really. Especially now. I really can't do anything right now. Okay, that's slightly better, but not actually good at all still. Oh, I lose. I just 100% lose. He played every single thing he could. Alright, that's GG. That's GG. That's a hard GG. Can I activate this? Yes, I can. Oh! Ah, oh, damn it. I don't, I, you know, actually, I could potentially steal her... Nope, I fucked that up, so now I just lose. There's no point in continuing this. I drew literally one of the worst fucking hands in the world, so there was no way for me to win that one. And he drew what's probably the best counter of that one, where I can't use Bellamy if they're five. Literally, Raph runs just a shit ton of fours. I don't know what happened there. But you know, it happens. Sometimes you just draw bad. Even the best decks draw kind of bad. So let's let's end it with this one. I think around three games is a pretty good length. And funny enough, you can also run. Um, aren't I in free play? Who gives a fuck? It's a, am I? Did I enter rank by accident or something? Oh man, this is another just not good hand. All right, that's slightly better. It's still not good because um, these are both dudes I don't want to activate first. That's just not helping me at all. Shit, and that makes it way worse. Maybe if I wait long enough, I can just steal one of him, one of the, one of her shit. Yeah, just, I'll just return you. Still not drawing any good monsters though. 
And she can just play him again. If she wants, yeah, she wants to. Fuck it, I'm just gonna play him. Okay. Give me, give me, give me, give me. Thank you. I mean, she can stop it, I think. She chooses not to, that's fine. Simple. She, she, she can use another one, honestly, if she wants to. Okay. That's not gonna save him. I don't think so. No, it's not gonna save him. She's gonna kill him first. Actually, that's not gonna work out, because I'm just gonna kill him now, and then I'll live. Told you. Let's see, what happens next? What's a good play here? Hmm. Hmm, what do I want to do here? I can just do this. And also activate. Uh, no. She can waste another one on him. Honestly, it's fine. But it's up to her. That's her last one if she does. She can only seal so many cards if she's not running Seatsy. If she's running max Seatsy, then she can seal up to six dudes, but... I don't know how green does with that recently, honestly. Mm. Slight problem, for sure. Let's just activate that, turn that back to your hand so you get no yawn. She's dead with this. Yeah, I told you. Unfortunately, Bellamy is not going to die from this, so Hunk is just going to go down next turn. Yeah, see? He's just going to go down. Hmm. And then you go down. Shadow Blade? Okay, sure. I don't think it gets yawn, right? I don't think it gets yawn, right? No, it just gets... It just gets that. Uh, return that back to your hand. Come on. Is, that, is this the point? I'm actually kind of surprised that Chun-Li has not... She must feel very confident in her ability to beat this. Actually, she can totally take down my Dante now. Huh. Clever girl. Or she could just do that, actually. I mean, that's also a waste, I feel, but fine. Do what you want to do, dude. I don't know why she did that. You could literally have played... Why did you do that? I don't understand. Uh, is that why you did it? I mean... Uh, you want to be real with me here. I'm about to take your shit because you're gonna take that much damage. Yeah Uh-huh do it again, please oh, Shit I misactivated activation so I might actually lose now cool 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 No, actually I won't because um, I I'll give it some time. It's fine. She can't win. I'm pretty positive she can't win anyway. Let's see. Yeah, I just need to wait for seven. Then once I activate seven, I'll do that, and then you can die. Because I deal exactly six, six damage. And I get all that health back. And, oh, okay, sure. I was wondering where the fuck you were. But again, I've bought myself some time. Probably won't activate something again until... Oh, you really want to keep your seat, see, huh? 
I mean, that's fine. Are you gonna make a copy of Virus? Okay. Sure, okay. That's fine. That's really annoying, but it's fine. Because I can just wait and then... Hmm. Yeah, wait right here. Take her. Thank you. actually pretty troubling. She would actually beat me now. I don't really think I can do much right now. I kind of want to take the Chris. So I'm going to take the Chris. Or I could just actually kill him. That works for me too, I guess. Four damage. Oh, make a copy of him though. That's fine. I really can't do anything to stop it, if I'm being honest, so. I just need to wait until someone dies. There you go. She'll die right here. Well, you just return to the hand. How about that? Because I actually don't want to accidentally draw you. Oh, that's not going to work out either way, though. Mm. Actually, yeah, it should work out because she has a shield. Oh, you little bastard. Alright, I guess I'll draw another card. He returned as a nine. Okay, slightly better again. Uh, damn it. That works. Okay. Now can I win? Can I win? <laughs> I guess not. Uh, can I stop you in time? Is it really worth paying half my life? I guess so. At this point, I think if this guy wins, he deserves to win. Because this was supposed to end close to 10 minutes ago. And instead, we had the longest fucking fight in human history. cards in my hand. Oh shit, this is actually kind of bad. Okay, that works. Do I win now? Thank you! Oh my god! <laughs> wow, that was a good fight. I'm sorry, I take back everything I said about Chun-Li. Chun-Li could have easily beat my shit multiple times during that entire fight. Oh my god. Uh, this deck's good, man. And this deck's pretty fun to play as well, as long as you learn what every card does and all that good stuff. Ooh, I got three Mega Shots. So that's been my Teppin video. This was a long one, man. Jesus Christ. Um, if you liked it, leave a like, and I hope you enjoyed this super long-ass video. Until next time, everyone, goodbye.